Hello my children. So today we are back again with another topic subtraction. In class 3 you have already learned subtraction consisting of four digits or less than four digits. But here in this class we use the same idea of subtraction consisting of five or more than five digits. But before starting that you should know some terms used in subtraction. First is minuet. What is minuet? The larger number from which we subtract the other number is known as minuet. Next is subtrahend. The number which is subtracted is called subtrahend. Whereas the result obtained after subtraction is known as difference. Let me show you with some examples. Here it is written subtract 5,61,375 from 9,4628. But before that, you, sh you have to find that which number is minuend and which number is subtrahend. Minuend is always the number from which we subtract the other number. Minuend is always bigger. As which number is larger? 9,4628. So this number is known as minuend. And this number, the number for, uh, which is subtracted is called subtrahend. Now after finding the minuend and subtrahend, we uh, are going to place them according to the place value chart. And one more thing, whatever number is written after from, that number is always larger. So this is our minuend. Now after arranging these digits according to the place value chart, like 9,4628, then we are going to put subtraction sign 5,61,375. Now we have to start subtraction. First we have to see, can we easily subtract 5 from 8? Yes, because 8 is larger number. So 8 minus 5 gives you 3. Now uh, we are going to start with 10 stitch, 10 place. Here, can we subtract 7 from 2? No, because 2 is a smaller number. So for that, we have to take borrow. When we will take borrow, this will become 12 and this will become 5. Now, 12 minus 7 gives you 5. Now, next, in the same way, can first we have to see, can we easily subtract 3 from 5? Yes, because 5 is larger number. So 5 minus 3 gives you 2. Now, 4 minus 1, no need to take borrow because 4 is the larger number and we can easily subtract. So, 4 minus 1 gives you 3. In the same way, here it is written 0 minus 6. We cannot subtract 6 from 0. So, again what we have to do, we have to take borrow. So, when we will take borrow, this will become 10 and 9 will become 8. Now, 10 minus 6 gives you 4. And 8 minus 5 gives you 3. So what is our final answer? 3,43,253 which is known as different. Example 2. Here it is mentioned minuend is equal to 9 lakhs and subtrahend is equal to 4 lakhs 8 10 thousands. First we are going to arrange it in numeral form so it would be easy for us to subtract. Here M stands for minuend. Minuend is equal to 9 lakhs. So 9 multiplied by 1 lakh gives you 9 lakh. Here S stands for subtrahend 4 lakhs 8 10 thousands. So 4 lakhs means 4 multiplied by 1 lakh will give you 4 lakh. Plus 8 10 thousands. 8 multiplied by 10 thousand gives you 80 thousands. So 4 lakh plus 80 thousand is equal to 4 lakh 80 thousand. Now again we will follow the same criteria of arranging them in the place value chart. Uh, first we are going to write minuend that is 9 lakh and then 4 lakh 80 thousand as subtrahend. Now we are going to subtract simply as 0 minus 0 will give you 0. Same in the tens place, hundreds place and thousands place. For ten thousands here we cannot subtract 8 from 0. So we have to take borrow. When we take borrow, this will become 10 and 9 will become 8. So 10 minus 8 gives you 2 and 8 minus 4 gives you 4. So our difference is 4,20,000. Now our next topic is property of subtraction. 
first property says that we cannot change the order of numbers in subtraction because a smaller number is always subtracted from a larger number. For example, 589. 589 is a larger number and 321 is a smaller number. So we can easily subtract these two. But if we change the order of these numbers, then 321 is a smaller number and 589 is a larger number. And we cannot subtract easily from this. So this is wrong. We cannot change the order of numbers. Second property says that when a number is subtracted from itself, the difference obtained is zero. For example, if I write 728 minus 728, it means I am subtracting the same number from itself. The result always gives zero. The difference obtained is zero always. Third property says that when zero is subtracted from a number, the difference is the number itself. For example, 8,421 uh, minus 0. When uh, we are subtracting 0 from a number, from a particular number, the difference is always the number itself. Now let us use what we have learned in subtraction to solve word problems. To solve any word problem, first we have to read the word problem, understand the concept and then apply mathematical operation. So, but before that, there are some terms which imply subtraction. These are minus, less than, difference, decrease and deduct. Now let us see uh, some examples of word problems. First is the sum of two numbers is 29,312. If one of the number is 14,170, find the other number. Now here... Uh, first, we have to understand it, what the question is saying. Here, the sum of two number given is 29,312. Sum of two numbers is given 29,312. Now, they are saying if one of the number is 14,170. If any one number is 14,170, we have to find this number. Now, how we can find this number? by subtracting it from this number, from min win, because this number is larger number. Here we are going to write some of the two number given is this, one number is this and how we will find the other number by subtracting these two. For working 29,312, 14,170. Now we can easily subtract 0 from 2. So 2 minus 0 gives you 2. Here this we, uh, this we have learned in property also. Now here we cannot subtract 7 from 1 as 1 is smaller number. So we will take uh, the borrow. It will become 11 and 3 will become 2. So 11 minus 7 gives you 4. Now 2 minus 1 we can easily subtract gives you 1. 9 minus 4, 5 and 2 minus 1, 1. So the other number is 15,142. Now let us see other example. What must be added to 6,33,891 to get 8,93,422? First we have to understand what the question is saying. What must be added to this number? If I uh, give you one example with some smaller number uh, is that if I ask from you what must be added to 6 to get 10. What must be added? Which number must be added to 6 to get 10? You can easily say 4 because 6 plus 4 gives you 10. So in the same way, what must be added to 6,33,891 to get this number? It means we have to subtract to find the required number. As we have written the required number, 8,93,422 minus 6,33,891. Now for working, we'll um, arrange them according to the place value chart. And after arranging, we can easily subtract 2 minus 1 gives you 1. Here we cannot subtract 9 from 2. So again, we will take borrow. This will become 12. 12 minus 9 gives you 3. And as 4 will become 3, Again, we cannot subtract 8 from 3. So, again, we will take borrow. This will become 13 and 3 will become 2. Now, 13 minus 8 gives you 5. Now, 
uh, here we cannot subtract 3 from 2 so again we will take borrow from here and 9 will become 8 so 12 minus 3 gives you 9 8 minus 3 no need to take borrow again because 8 is a larger number 8 minus 3 gives you 5 and here 8 minus 6 gives you 2 so our required number is 2,59,531 hope you enjoyed revising these subtraction uh, top concepts enjoy